The lecture attracted stakeholders in the Nigerian creative sector, captains of industry, government officials, as well as educational instructors. The aim of the lecture was to sensitize the public on the economic significance of intellectual properties. The guest speaker, Professor Heldronin, explained that the Nigerian creative industry must be developed as talents must not be ex exploited. Cultural industries are concerned with the generation of communications and public meaning. Cultural activities whose primary purpose is to communicate symbols, ideas, and meanings play a central role in our ability to communicate and thus in the freedom of human expression. The chairman, Copyright Society of Nigeria, Chief Tony Okorogi, told NTA News that our legislature's backing the rights of creative works produced by, by Nigerian artists as a whole. This, it says, covers the theater, movie, music, arts and films, among others. That Nigeria must begin to deal with intellectual property as important as anyone else or anything else because the future of our nation depends on the creativity of our young people. Uh, we have shown that with what has happened with the revolution in Nigerian music. So much want jobs to be created uh, in this country to our teaming unemployed uh, youth and the role of the creativity industry in the creation and generation of employment amongst youth has been very well uh, highlighted. Speakers at the forum also noted that the unifying features of the creative industry is relevant to national development as jobs and wealth will be created for economic advancement.